What is going on everyone? This is Brad of Demon Asylum here. I'm bringing you all a new Destiny video in which I'm going to be showing you the Queen's Emissary Shop and what it has to offer that came along with the Queen's Wrath update today. In order to actually buy anything from the shop, you're going to need to get your reputation up for the update, which is called Queen's Favor, and you get it up by doing Reef Bounties, the new bounties that also came out with the update today. I believe to get rank 1 for the shop, you have to have a thousand reputation. And there is items in the shop that require you to have rank 1, 2, and 3. So let's go over here. In order to get to the shop, you just go where the Iron Banner used to be in the Destiny beta, right in front of uh, the bounty board and the bounty tracker. You go up the stairs in front of it and then through the big walkway and just come to the end here. On the left in the shop, just like with uh, Vanguard and Crucible NPCs that you buy items from, it shows your reputation on the left. I have 350 out of 1,000. I have done four bounties so far. And then you actually purchase all of these items with Glimmer. There are no marks for this type of reputation. It is just Glimmer you purchase these items with, and that's why there's no legendaries in this shop, and also why there's such a minimal amount of items you can actually choose from. So here you have two shaders, one which requires you to have rank 1, and one which requires you to have rank 3. You have a uh, Rose Gold, and then you have Prism Dancer. You have a Queen's Guard Crest Emblem, which requires you to have rank 1. Crown of the Sovereign Emblem, which requires rank 3. You have a Class Armor, Mark of the Queen's Guard, which requires rank 2. If you're a Hunter, this will be a Class Armor for Hunter, and same thing for Warlock. If you're a Warlock, you'll have a Class Armor for you. Down here, we have three weapons, which of course will be the same for everybody, as well as the emblems and the shaders. Uh, they're all rare, and again, you can just purchase them with Glimmer if you want to. They max out at 242 damage, which is the most that a rare weapon can actually have. So these are pretty good if you don't have one of these yet. Just get your rank up to 2, and then you can easily purchase them with a couple thousand Glimmer, which is not hard to get at all. So we have the Her Right Hand Auto Rifle, the Vesta Noblesse or Noblesse Scout Rifle, and then you have the Merciless Hand Cannon. And they all have the same sort of color scheme and design, which is actually pretty cool. I know a lot of people may not like pinkish or purple type colors here, but I think they actually have a pretty sweet design. Not only that, but the weapons themselves look really cool in my opinion. I'm definitely going to be getting at least one or two of these items in the shop. And also, one thing I noticed about the shop is there's no area where it says that the stock is going to refresh at all. So I'm not sure if these are the items that are going to stay in this shop until October 6th when this whole update goes away. Or if maybe they'll change it one time next week on Tuesday when they usually do their updates and everything. But I guess for now, this is what we have. And uh, we'll just have to wait and see what happens. But that's pretty much it for this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please be sure to give this video a like and subscribe for more Destiny videos to come. Thanks for watching, everybody, and peace out.